Vectors cases in 1994, paper 1, question number 24. In the figure below, AB is given as A, AD is given by B, AX, XC is given by 2 is to 3, the ratio. Then we have the other ratio that is um, DX, XB, that is given as um, 4 is to 5. Uh, so the first part of the question, which is A, express AC to DC in terms of A and B in the simplest form. And then if DC is equals to NA plus MB, find the values of N and M. So let's go direct to the solution. So given that AX, XC is 2 is to 3, that is the ratio. And then um, DX, XB is given as a 4 is to 5. So let's go to the first part of the question, which is part one. We want to find AC in terms of A and B. So to get that, uh, we need to use uh, that ratio that we have identified above there, which is AC, XC. That ratio is given as uh, 2 is to 3. So using that ratio, AX, AX therefore, will be given by 2 over 5 AC. So using that ratio, that is what you can get. Then from this, uh, we can make uh, AC the subject, which will give uh, 5 over 2 AX. So AC is equals to 5 over 2 AX. So we need to find that AX so that we get now uh, AC in full. So let's find AX. So AX is um, obtained by, let's go to the diagram, that is AX. So AX, we shall use this root AB, BX. AB plus BX. That is the root that we're going to follow, the direction. So now from that, we have AB. AB is given as A. AB is given as A. Then BX. BX, uh, we need to find BX. BX is a 5 over 9 BD using that ratio 5 over 9 BD so that is equals to a plus 5 over 9 BD we need to find BD so from B to D we are going to follow the root of BA AD BA plus AD that is the root you're going to follow so BA plus AD So that will give uh, A plus 5 over 9. So we need to get BA. BA is, uh, can obtain that. BA is, we are going the negative direction, opposite direction. So it will be negative A. That will be negative A. So negative A plus AD will be given by B. So we open this bracket. A plus, uh, this will be negative, negative 5. Uh, over 9a plus this will be 5 over 9b now put the like terms together that is a minus 5 over 9a which you will give when you subtract that you get 4 over 9a plus uh, this will be plus 5 over 9b so that is the vector uh, for AX. Remember we have been finding AX, which will assist us to get AC. So that is vector AX. Now, having obtained that, we can now proceed and get AC since we had obtained AC as 5 over 2 AX. 
So AC was 5 over 2 AX. So we can get this one as 5 over 2. Then AX, we have already obtained AX. And uh, we can just need to insert that. 4 over 9A plus 5 over 9B. Then from there, we open the brackets by multiplying everything by 4 over 2. And this shall give... We multiply these, we shall get 10 over 9 is 10 over 9, be 10 over 9a plus 25 over 18b. So that is AC. And now we have obtained AC. So that is uh, the first part of the question. Now let's go to the second part of the question. And the second part of the question is... Um, DC in terms of A and B in the simplest form. So we need to get DC. So to get DC, uh, we need to identify the route we are going to follow from D to C. So let's go to the diagram. Mm, so DC, now you can see. So to get that, we need to use DA plus DA plus DC plus AC, that is a DA plus AC, that is the route you're going to follow. So DA, do we have DA? Uh, from the diagram, we have DA will be negative B, as you can see it is in the opposite direction. So that will be negative B plus AC will be given by 10 over 9A plus 25. We had already obtained that in the previous part. So for AC, we just need to insert it the way it is. So like terms, uh, we group together B and B. So negative B, negative B plus 25 over 18, uh, that is B plus 10 over 9A. That will give... Um, when you simplify that, we shall get uh, 7 over 13b plus 10 over 9a. So that is DC in terms of A and B. Now, we need to go to the last part of the question now. The last part of the question is, uh, given that DC is equals to NA plus MB, find the values of N and M. Something missing there, N and M. So those are the scalars. We need to find the scalars. And that one is very straightforward since we have obtained DC. So remember DC was, um, we have been given DC as NA plus uh, MB. So we, we're just going to use that expression for DC. And then we identify the scalars. So 10 over 9A plus M, which is um, GMB 7 over 13B. We just need to, that is N, is going to match with that. And then um, N will match. So we just need to pick N is equivalent to 10 over 9. And then for the vector B that are matching, this uh, M is given by 7 over 13. That is simply how you're supposed to work out that question.